So we've been bringing stuff out to the trailer, which means we're almost completely packed up, ready to go. This time we're gonna go up to Niagara Falls. Looking forward to it. Let's go. So if you're gonna go to Niagara Falls, this is a pretty good way to do it. We decided last year after we went, we drove to Niagara Falls and back in one day. And that's about a five hour drive for us. Everybody tired? Yes, yes. very tired. <laughs> we decided that was fun, but this year, let's take our time. So we decided to stay at Four Mile Creek State Park. It is right up by Fort Niagara on Lake Ontario. We actually have a waterfront site It's very conveniently located to Niagara Falls. It's about a 20 minute drive down the road, so it's not too bad. But considering that we paid $35 a night to stay here, um, now it is electric only. There are probably more convenient locations with some full hookups. But then again, you're gonna get the typical RV park style, a little closer together, close to a highway. So we decided to go a little bit further and go to the state park. And I will say, I'm pretty impressed. This is a very big, wide open campground, uh, very large sites. So when we checked in, they were really nice. Chairs in the window. It's warm. So when we checked in, they were really nice. Campos showed us her site, showed us where to get water. They were really helpful. And actually he informed me something I didn't know. When you stay here, you actually get free parking at any of the state parks. So that includes the Niagara Falls, which is normally $10 to park, either lot number one or two or three out on Goat Island. So we could park anywhere we wanted, just show our pass. And we didn't feel like we had to stay all day to get uh, make good use of our, our parking our parking cost. So that was really nice. It was a bonus. We didn't know that when we reserved it, but when we checked in, they were really helpful to make sure that we knew that. So good benefit. Make sure you take advantage of that if you come here. So our, our two nights for $70 saved me $20 in parking because we used two different parking lots that way. Kayla, where are we? Niagara Falls State Park. Yep. <laughs> Niagara Falls State Park, lot two on Goat Island. <laughs> so behind me right there is the entrance to the Cave of the Winds where you get right up against the American Falls. We did that last year. don't remember the price, but it's not cheap. It's right around 20 bucks a person. It was a lot of fun. We would definitely do that again. It's just this year we're making it a little bit quicker. We're gonna wait and see the falls after dark, so kind of excited for that.
falls behind us. Over 600,000 gallons per second go over that. Wow. See those lights over there? They light it up on the Canadian side. Falls varies between 70 and 100 feet because of the boulders at the bottom. Yeah. So we are obviously on the beautiful shores of Lake Ontario. There's our party and neighbors. But these sites are great. They are very open, very large. And I like how green they are. There's just grass everywhere. We've really enjoyed this place so far. But the one thing, since if you look over here, this is electric only, we were kind of concerned about the bathhouses. So we were relieved to find they're pretty nice. Bathhouses are clean. Four shower stalls. Handicap. You got a bench. Two curtains. And there is a separate entrance for the shower. And there's my beautiful wife. <laughs> Eat plenty of food, we're gonna be walking a lot.
went straight from the falls up here to Devil's Hole State Park. took the most treacherous steps ever. Treacherous steps. These look better. It's so we're working our way down oh, now. We're going to take the regular stairs. We started up at the top Raining of the hill. So we're just about a mile up the road from Niagara Falls, right? Yeah. And we are at Devil Hole, Devil's Hole State Park. And apparently we're walking down into Devil's Hole. Very interesting name. Oh, no. Look at this though. You don't want to fall off the edge of this tiny little wall. Which is why daughter's on the safe side. Yes. Just walked down that hill. Climbing, climbing, climbing. Not for the faint of heart. But it's just stairs, it's easy. Climbing, 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 climbing. Ever. Making our way out of Devil's Hole. So Devil's Hole State Park Trail, what'd you think? Fire Cool though. Anyone, anyone count the stairs? Nope. I'm too tired to count. <laughs> in squat formation. Oh, pizza. It's like a rock with cute little weights. <laughs> yeah. I'm still good. But it's weird if I kept this one. shouldn't. Yes. No, we probably shouldn't.